Dr. Maxis. What it is. I'm Kevin with Scorchard Gaming, and I'm back on Uncharted 3 Drake's Deception. We're about to break in the museum. Okay, I made it. If you remember the last at the end at the loop. At the end of the last episode, I jumped out there and died. It's a really slow shimmy. And there we go. Let me turn the camera. There we go. So where was that window? Okay, there it is. If we go this way. I'm about to find something to jump on. Perfect. Can we get on this roof? Fuck yeah, getting on all the roofs. Yeah, so you probably set this rule up for us too. What? Okay, that was pretty that was close. close. A treasure there or something? Let's see if there's treasure here. Now, a quick look see. Seems like there would be. Yep, there it is. Yoink. There's a fucking dog. With a fucking knife in its ass. The fuck is up with that? Okay, then we gotta get up. Can we use this? Nope. Okay, let's shimmy around here and use this, I'm assuming. I'm assuming we could use this. Yeah, there we go. And up. So where's that window? Let me turn the fucking camera. Here we go. Here we go. Boom. Okay. Perfect. What the fuck? He didn't have that in the first episode, did he? I don't think he did. Here we go. The ring. The whale of Sir Francis of Sir Francis Drake in baby whales. I'm waiting for the alarm to go off. Just me? Oh yeah, golden frisbee. Except with this one, you could kill someone with it if you hit them in the head. Don't do it right now. Take it with you and do it later. Whoa. Damn it, kid. Why have oh, I shit. Look who it is. The filthy little stray that made off with your wallet. Oh, boy. Come on, son. You haven't got a chance. Just hand it over. Now. The ring. Did you take it out? What ring? <laughs> That's right. Oh, shit. Who do you think you are, boy? You're nothing but a filthy, cast off little beggar. You're not fit to touch these objects. Head butter. What the hell do you think you're doing? He's just a kid. <laughs> Stop him! <laughs> Later, bitch. Stop the boy. Nope, he ain't stopping Holy shit. Crap, oh, fuck. Okay, he got me. <laughs> I ran straight into him. Holy crap. Dead. The ring. Now he got shit. Come on, climb. Climb the fucking axe thing. Up. No, don't break no door down. Oh, God. I'm fine. Don't worry about it. Just get the fuck. Run faster. Yeah, come on, come on. Break it. Hurry. Fuck you. Oh. Fuck you. Uh. Yeah, later, bitch. Tell that bitch I'm gone. Oh, crap. Oh, fuck. Who the hell are these guys? Where the fuck did they come from? Get on this and jump. Jump. Why? Why? Why did you fucking jump on the side of the building? Obviously, you wouldn't make it like that. You could have just sprinted and fucking made it. But no, you have to fucking do that. Who the like hell a are these dumbass. Guys? You want me to 
You really want no see? That's not what you fucking do, Drake. Let me do my idea and don't fucking grab onto no fucking edge of no fucking building. Just run and jump. Simple as Here. Get up on this. Now jump. There we go, see? Fuck you guy. Get up on this. Go fucking not very responsive. I know that's not very responsive, it's just it's awkward when it turns a corner and uh, you're pushing in the same direction you were to get there in the first place and then when you turn, it doesn't fucking do it fast enough. Oh shit, Jesus Christ! Okay, I gotta figure out a way down over here. Over here seems like the best bet. No, this time. No, shit. over there is not. What the fuck is he wearing? He not fucking sunglasses. Weird ass fucking goggles. Up here. Up again. Up. Enough of this. Shoot him. Don't shoot me. Shooting at me. Let me jump across here. Yes. I don't see why you needed to leap like that, Drake. No. Really? That killed me? Okay, put me up here now. Perfect. Won't be able to get me now, bitch. Okay, they're here. Later. Oh fuck. I'm going. You got a crazy girlfriend. Like fuck. She crazy as fuck. She's also self entitled. Oh shit. Oh fuck. I didn't die from that, but when I fell, normally, I died from it. Don't know why I, don't know why I did, stopped and did a little jump there. Hey! Oh, you fucking asshole! You had to be walking in that specific direction when I come in that fucking room, didn't you? Son of a bitch. Or at least he didn't fucking change direction as soon as I changed direction too. I was going to be able to do that. I was like, what the fuck is going on here? Whoop. I'm going to go through that. I don't know he is. Later. Oh, shit. Leave me alone. Stop shooting me. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Look what we have here. Whoops. Are you alright? I'm fine. What are you shaking for? Just close your eyes. This won't hurt a bit. You got fucked up cockles, dude. It wasn't obvious at this point. He's clearly not after me. Okay, kid. How they met was quite intense. Quite motherfucking intense. Relax, kid. We're safe here. Ooh, Santa. Suit yourself. You don't want it. Oh, I want it. What do you want from me? <laughs> the ring. A little gratitude would be nice. I did just save your ass back there. 
Thanks. But what's in it for you? I mean, you're a crook, right? <laughs> you gotta have an angle. <laughs> you are one piece of work, kid. What's your story, anyway? Look, mister. No offense, but I don't even know you. Easily remedied. Victor Sullivan. This would be the part where you introduce yourself. Okay. Suppose you tell me what's so special about that ring. It belongs in my family. I'm just taking it back. Passed down from Francis Drake himself. That's right. I don't know how to break this to you, kid, but Drake didn't have any heirs. No children. Well, not with his wife back in England, anyway. <laughs> okay, good point. Let me see it. Come on. All the kid. way in America? If I was going to take it from you, I would have done it by now. He does have a point. Thank you. So, what is this? Parvis? Mem Sick Parvis Magna. It means greatness from small beginnings. Ah. That was his motto. Yeah? You see, Queen Elizabeth gave it to him in 1581, when he got back to England after circumnavigating the globe. That's when she made him a knight. Well, you sure as hell didn't learn that on the streets. How's a kid your age know Latin? The nuns sort of insisted on it. Ah, so, like a boarding school. That's a nice word for it. Okay, then. So what was all that business with the ring and that astrolabe thing back there? Why don't you tell me? You're the one working for him. Look, kid. A client wants something, I obtain it. For a price. I don't ask any questions. It's just a job. Look pretty friendly to me. Yeah, uh, well... Anyway. I'm pretty sure I'm fired. Yeah. Say the least, definitely fired. Okay, look. First of all, that was no astrolabe. It was a fucking safe or some shit. It's some sort of decoding device. Check this out. Right. On Check his way around the world, Drake sailed through the East Indies. Only he says that it took him six months to get from here to here. Yeah, that's so? happening. So it doesn't add up. He was way too good a sailor for that. It would have taken him a month. Tops. He was hiding something. Treasure. Something big. How big? Like Very secret big. mission from the Queen big. Like oh, millions shit. in plundered treasure that hasn't ever been recovered big. That big? That big. And that decoder has something to do with it. I would bet my life on it. Oh, swell. Almost did. And Marlowe's got it. Won't do her much good without the key. So it's a stalemate then. For now. You need to get it. <laughs> so you still haven't told me what your name is. And you still haven't told me what you want from me. Okay. Look, you got talent, but you got a lot to learn. You stick with me and I'll teach you a few things. Thanks. But I'm doing just fine on my own. Yeah, clearly. Oh, I nearly got killed. What do you say we uh, try this again? My friends call me Sully. Nathan Drake. Nate. Drake, huh? Okay. I see great things in our future, kid. Great things. I also see some shit storms happening too. Have your mind I'm gonna have my food. Oh, oh Jesus Christ, we just got you out. Um, they did. They're gone. Alright, lads. Wait, what? <laughs> oh God. Thought you were gonna put a silencer on that thing. Sally, you've got no sense of drama. <laughs> right. <laughs> Right. What? All that racket's gonna bring the cops any minute. Let's get the hell out of here. <sighs> Could have pulled a couple of those punches, Charlie. What do you mean? I hardly touched you. You headbutted me. 
All right, all right. I got a little swept up in the moment. Yeah. You were the one who said make it look realistic. Better stay on his good side. All right, Brad Ice, look sharp. They're coming your way. Don't lose them. <sighs> Told you they'd take the bait. How long do you reckon before they realize this is a fake? Who cares? Finally flushed them out. And now we just follow them back to their hole. You do realize you make everything sound dirty. I do? Let's get moving. Yeah. Pretty dirty. Up, Shit. Oh, great. This way. Run to ground. What? Come on. We're going this way. Yes, really. What the Come fuck on, is happening with Sonny? He's claustrophobic. It'll be soon. It'll be over soon. It'll be over soon. That's it. That's it. That's it. Oh, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> the hell is wrong with you? Nothing. I'm fine. He's claustrophobic. If it's obvious for me, well, I suppose I'm claustrophobic too. So I'd be able to tell. That's blocked. Anyway, it wouldn't be too difficult to tell. Up this. Wait, we can get around this way. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. Or we could just use a little Remember this way? <laughs> oh. There's a thought. What am I doing? Get down. Walls go high. Yeah. Let's move this thing over there. there too. You gotta move this. I got it. Oh. Put your back into it, Okay, mate. there we go. Got all bloody night. Yeah. Thanks yeah, I know. Help. There, it's done, Kay. Come on, move your lazy asses. Oh, All look, right. a phone boot. Looks like the coast is clear. <laughs> oh, white van. You should be more careful it's with the game. suspicious. Good evening, lads. Oh. All right, darling. Hey. <sighs> Looks like hell spit you two back out. Yeah, uh, it was a thing of beauty, Chloe. I went off without a hitch. You're unusually quiet. What's up your bum? Oh, well, Charlie seemed to enjoy himself a little bit too much for my taste. Uh, <laughs> my ears are still ringing. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Helps if you have something in between. <laughs> well, it looks like I missed out on some fun. Yeah, you did, actually. It was very, very uh, cathartic. Yeah, it's funny. Do you have any trouble? Nah, <sighs> easy peasy. And you're sure they didn't see you trailing them? Not a chance. So, which door scary poppins hiding behind? Behind that one there. The green one. It's not a door. I drove in ages ago. Well, I suppose a garage door. Since. You think they're still in there? Well, I haven't taken my eyes off it. And no one's gone in or out. Well, I'd say yes. Hmm. Think these are really necessary? I mean, it's not like they're expecting us. Don't underestimate these blokes. They're not messing about. Hey, we're just going to sneak in and we sneak up. Just like that. Yeah, fair enough. But any trouble, you shoot first and ask questions later, all right? All right. I think we can do that. Man, I was sorely tempted to just pick up that briefcase back there and walk. Yeah, you got a lousy poker face, man. Hey, trust me, that's nothing compared to what we're on to. Yeah, well, at my age, a bird in the hand, you know. Ew. Didn't I tell you? Oh, please. Look, I just hope you're right about this. Better be right. Seems pretty quiet. That's an understatement. Think they're still in there? Well, we're not gonna just barge in the front door and find out. Well, we can't afford to waste time standing here. Uh, move, move. I'll find a way in. Check it out. You three stay here. I'm trying to climb this pole. Do to do. Shimmy shimmy. Do to do. Climbing up the pole. 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 Oh shit. Shoot me on the pole, shoot me on the pole. Shoot me on the Sorry pole, shoot me on the pole. It's gonna fall. No? Are we good? We're fine. Come on. There we go. They probably heard it. If, if they didn't hear anything, they probably heard me dropping on the roof. Since I don't exactly weigh a feather. Ah, uh, yoop. Oh, fuck. That's really bad. They definitely heard that. Oh, shit. And that. Things are not going well right now. 
How did they not hear any of this? Wait a minute, where did it go? Maybe that's why. Because they're not here. Where did they go, though? Ooh, treasure. What do you even mean for that? I'm just trying to find a way fucking down. Here? No. I'm not really sure where to... Out here? Yeah. Here we go. Almost. Why is that there? Boom. Where the fuck? Where the hell did they go? This doesn't just, make any sense. They're just fucking gone. Why did you jump at the door? There we go. That was a pain in the ass to activate. Give me a hand with this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. Okay, well. They're not out here with those trees, so Does that's see good. A car? Cause I don't see a car. I don't understand. I don't see shit. Are you sure this is the right one? Yes, the green door, I'm sure. Mate, we are losing time here. And that damn briefcase is looking better and better. Alright, come on. They didn't just vanish into thin air, right? There's gotta be an explanation. Looks like they did. Spread out, look around. They were here, alright. I can still smell the exhaust. Did they do some Back to the Future shit? Tire tracks. Still wet from the rain. Okay. Looks like the car turned here. And then fucking... Oh! It's a fucking elevator. Hey, check this out. Stand on them. Some kind of mechanism. Yeah. It's an elevator. How about genius? Four tires, four points of contact. Sully, stand right there. You two, like there and there. Going in. All right, everybody, on three. Ready? One, two, three. And? Well, this has got to be it. And you scan the environment. You need something heavy, I'd wager. What does it get me to scan? really know what it wants me to scan. I would just assume get something heavier to put on the mechanism. Um, okay, and it's not press or three around like that. It's just, oh wait, there we go. Wait, it's the light. Sully, a aim your beam at the wall. Like headlights. Hi there. Oh, they just dug a big old fucking mine shaft through this fucking place. Oh, goddamn cadaver. Um, Nate, just who are we dealing with here? Uh, there's only one way to find out. We'll track the car. You head back to the van. We'll try and stay in radio contact. I'll let you know when we get through to the other side, all right? <laughs> Wherever the hell that is. Just be ready for anything. Might be a quick Like exit. getting us out of here? She's the best driver in the business, you know. So I've heard. Are we acting like we don't know her or something? Okay. I'm going to end this episode here. And in the next one, we'll find out who the fuck we're dealing with. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one. Sayonara.